Good day, my dear learners! Welcome to Isabella Telescuela. Come and join me in our Musica Rinungan and Musica Siyahan lesson. Yes, I am jolly, but not a bee. I am... Teacher JB. Do you want to learn something new in music? Come on and join me again. If you don't know music, nothing to worry. We will discuss it today. Teacher Jamie, that's how they call me. Yes, I'm jolly, but not a bee. Teacher Jamie, that's how they call me. Let's go learn together. I am very happy that you are always present in our daily lessons. So my dear learners, get your ball pen, your module, and your activity notes because we will now begin our music lesson. Let's go! In our last meeting, we have started discussing the traditional music of Africa. Didn't we? Yes, sir! Can you give me the different vocal forms of African music? Yes, Wilbert? One of the vocal forms is Marakati. Very good, Wilbert. Any other example? Yes, Diane? Another example is blues, sir. Exactly, Diane. Give me another one, Don. Soul is included, sir. That's great, Don. What about you, Florife? Spiritual is also on the list, sir. Precisely, Florife. What else, class? Yes, Prince? Lastly is the call and response, sir. You are right, Prince. The different vocal forms of African music are maracatu, blues, soul, spiritual, and call and response. African traditional music is mainly functional in nature, which is used primarily in ceremonial rites such as birth, death, marriage, succession, worship, and spirit invocations. Others are work-related or social in nature, while many traditional societies view their music as a form of entertainment. Very good job! I am amazed that you can remember our previous lessons. Let us move on to a fun-filled activity titled Start the balloon. You are all excited, aren't you? Yes, sir! I have here a set of pictures of musical instruments, and each picture is inside a balloon. Using a dart, you need to shoot the balloons to reveal the clues for you to classify the instruments. After classifying the instruments, they will be placed in their respective backpacks so that we can use them in our discussions. Did I make myself clear, class? Yes, sir! Do you have any question or clarification regarding the activity? None, none sir! If none, let us begin. We have five backpacks here. First is for guitar-like. Second is for flute-like. Third is for piano-like. Fourth is for drum-like. And last is for lyre-like. As you can see, we have 10 balloons at the board. All you need to do is to shoot them all using a dart. So are you now ready to shoot all the balloons? Let's start! Where should we place this? If your answer is liar, you are right! Share me your answer! If you place it on drums, that is correct. How about this instrument? The answer is flute. Do we have the same answer? That's great! Did you place this on the group of guitars? If yes, great job! What does this instrument look like? 
Yes, it looks like a mini piano. Very good! Where should we place this one? If your answer is drums, you are right! Share me your answer. If you place it on flute, you got the correct answer. How about this instrument? The answer is lyre. Do we have the same answer? That's great! Did you place this in the group of pianos? If yes, great job! What does this instrument look like? Yes, it looks like a guitar. Very good! Congratulations class! Excellent! I am very happy that you finished your task. All your answers are correct. And because of that, I will give you a jolly amazing club. Club, club, club. Jolly, jolly amazing club, club. As you look at the pictures in our activity, who can tell me where do these instruments come from? Yes, Irish? I think these are African musical instruments and come from Africa, sir. Exactly, Irish. Since you have mentioned African musical instruments, let us talk about it. This time, we will call a friend. His name is Mr. Jokebox. Let us try to describe the characteristics of the traditional instruments of Africa through a listening activity. Yes, you heard it right. Together with Mr. Jukebox, we will be having an activity titled, When You Hear It, Describe It. This activity is very simple. Mr. Jukebox will play music. Then, you will describe the sound and appearance of the musical instruments. I know that you are all excited, aren't you? Yes, sir! So if you don't have any clarification, let's begin! It looks and sounds like cowbells, and it has stick. It is basically came from animal horn, and the sound is like a bass trumpet. I can hear a vibrating metal. It seems like it is made up of a spoon. I can hear shells and it's like a maracas. The sounds were produced by a string. The coconut shell helps to amplify the sound of the instrument. The sound were produced by the hands and the feet. Congratulations class! You did a great job for your listening activity and you all deserve a round of applause. Did you know class that all these traditional musical instruments of Africa are grouped into five? These are ejaphones, membranophones, lamellophones, chordophones, and aerophones. Sir JB, what are the differences among these five types of instruments? Very good question, Diane. I know that you are not familiar with these groups of instruments. That is why I call for help. As we enter the music world, we will meet a new friend and join us till the end. She brings us vocabularies, for sure you'll learn no worries. So listen and watch, sit back and relax, together we Miss Dictionary She is Miss Dictionary, or we can call her Miss D. She will help us to understand the different groups of African musical instruments. Are you ready, Mrs. D? Let's go!
The sound earphones is produced by the body of the instrument vibrating. Who can give me the examples of earphones? Yes, Prince? These are marching lyres and marimba, sir. Very good, Prince. You are right. Lyres and marimba are examples of instruments that produce sounds through vibrations. Now, let us classify these African instruments if it belongs to earphones or not. Let us see if you can classify earphones. Let us try this one. Does the sound produced by a vibrating body instrument? Yes, it is. Very good. How about this one? Is your phone or not? You are right. This is is your phone. Let us look at this. If your answer is no, great job! What do you think of this? Share me your answer. If you answered yes, that's correct. I know you know this. I know you answered yes because this is an Ija phone. How about this? Yes, it is an Ija phone. Do we have the same answer? That's great! Job well done, my dear learners! You classified the instruments correctly. To understand it better, let us hear the historical and cultural background of these instruments from Miss D. A go, go It is a single bell or multiple bells and is considered as the oldest samba instrument based on on West African Yoruba, single or double bells. It has the highest pitch of any of the bateria instruments. Shakere. It is a type of cord and shell megaphone from West Africa, consisting of a dried cord with beads woven into a net covering the gourd. Slit or log drum. It is a hollow percussion instrument Although known as a drum, it is not a true drum, but it is an egyphone. It is usually carved or constructed from bamboo or wood into a box with one or more slits in the top. A ting ting con or slit gong. It is a hollowed cylinder of wood with a narrow longitudinal opening or slit whose edges are struck to produce a deep sonorous tone. They are considered to be portraits of ancestors so that when played, it is the voices of awakened ancestors which resonate from their interior chamber. Balafon It is a kind of wooden xylophone or percussion egyphone which plays melodic tunes. It has been played in the region since the 1300s. In the 16th century, it became a real art at the royal court of Sikasu, Mali, and was flourishing 
under the reign of a generous king. This time, I want you to classify the instruments according to their sounds and give their similar characteristics. Are you now ready? Let's go! Let us look at this. It, it sounds like a drum! Yes, it is. Very good. Let us try this one. Share me your answer. It sounds like a guitar. That's correct. How about this one? It, it sounds like a drum. Yes, it is. Very good. I know you know this. That's correct. Great job, my dear learners. At this point, class, can you please describe these instruments? Yes, Irish? The instruments are like drums. They are made with animal skin, woods, and bamboos. The sounds can be produced by the collision of hand towards the instruments or the collision of the body parts, sir. You are amazing, Irish. Your observations are great. These instruments are actually belonging to membranophones. To understand it better, here is Miss D. The membranophone sound is produced by the vibration of a tightly stretched membrane. The examples of this are body percussion, talking drum, and zembe. Body percussion. It refers to African music using their bodies as instruments. Their body can be used to produce sound by clapping their hands, slapping their thighs, pounding their upper arms or chests, or shuffling their feet, wearing of rattles or bells on their wrists, ankles, arms, and waists enhances their emotional response. Talking drum It is used to send messages to announce births, deaths, marriages, Sporting events, dances, initiations, or war. It is believed that the drums can carry direct messages to the spirits after the death of a loved one. Zambe The West African Zambe is one of the best known African drums. It is shaped like a large goblet and played with bare hands. The body is curved from a hollow trunk and is covered with goat skin. At this point in time, I want you again to classify the instruments according to their sound and give their similar characteristics. Let us look at this. Yes, it is. Very good. Let us try this one. Share me your answer. It, it sounds like a flute. That's correct. How about this one? It 
sounds like a piano. Yes, it is. Very good. Wilbert, I know that you observe carefully. Please share your observations. The instruments are like pianos. The sounds are being produced by tickling a metallic tongue. Your observations are impressive, Wilbert. These instruments belong to lamellia phones. To understand it better, here is Miss D. The lamellia phone sound is produced by the vibration of tongues of metal, wood, or other material. The examples of this are Mbira and Ari Mbira. Mbira or the Kalimba or Tom Piano. It is a set of plot tines or keys mounted on a soundboard. It is being played by holding the instrument in the hands and plucking the tines with the toms. They use this instrument to drive away evil spirits since it is believed that it was a vector of communication with ancestors and spirits. Arayambira It is a handcrafted instrument with a unique harp or bell-like sound. It is a popular traditional instrument of the Shona people in Zimbabwe. It is a radical redesign of the African Mbira, and it consists of up to 150 metal tines attached to a wooden board comprising up to 5 octaves. Now, I would like you to listen to the sounds of these instruments. Let us look at this. Yes, it is. Very good. Let us try this one. Share me your answer. It, it sounds like a guitar. That's correct. How about this one? Guitar. Yes, it is. Very good. Yes, Don? The sounds are made by the strings attached to them. Precisely, Don. Does this mean, Sir JB, that these instruments belong to chordophones since there are chords attached to them? Exactly, Che. To better understand what chordophones is, here is Miss D. The chordophone sound is produced by the vibration of a string or strings that are stretched between fixed points. The examples of this are musical bow and zeze. Musical bow. The musical bow is the ancestor of all string instruments. It is the oldest and one of the most widely used strings instruments of Africa. It consists of a single string attached to each end of a curved stick similar to a bow and arrow. Zeze The zeze is an African fiddle played with a bow, a small wooden stick or plucked with the fingers. It has one or two strings, made of steel or bicycle brake wire. It is from Sub-Saharan Africa. I know that many of you are using chordophones, didn't you? Can you give me one, Diane? I am a fan of using acoustics and electric guitars. That's correct, Diane. How about you, Florife? I love to use my ukulele, Sir G. Ukulele is also an example of chordophone. Thank you, Florife. So let us proceed to the last group of instruments. Let us look at this. Yes, it is. Very good. Let us try this one. It sounds like a guitar. 
Share me your answer. It sounds like a flute. That's correct. How about this one? It sounds like a flute. Yes, it is. Very good. Based on what you heard, who wants to describe these instruments? Yes, Prince? These instruments need air to produce sounds. They are made up of bamboo and animal horns. You are a keen observer, Prince. You are amazing. These instruments are called aerophones. The aerophone sound is produced through the vibration of air. The examples of this are Fulani and Kudu horn. Fulani it is a type of flute which is widely used throughout Africa and either vertical or side blown. They are usually fashioned from a single tube, closed at one end, and blown like a bottle. Kudu horn. It is made from the horn of the kudu antelope. Its sound releases a mellow and warm sound that adds a unique African accent to their music. There you have it, my dear learners. Those are the five types and examples of the traditional musical instruments of Africa. Do you have any clarification about this? None, no, sir. Very good. I know that all of you gave attention to our lesson for today. At this juncture, we will be exploring more African musical instruments. I want you to perform any type of African music that we have discussed last meeting using any available instruments in your home as long as it belongs to the five types of instruments. For those who don't have any instruments, you have two options. First, you will make an improvised African instrument using recyclable or indigenous materials. Second, you can download mobile applications as an alternative instrument that can produce the desired sounds. Remember that you need to video your performance and upload it on our Facebook page titled TN Bida Kadito. This page is created to support the National Drug Education or NDEP of the Department of Education called Barcada Contra Droga. This only proves that music is also an alternative platform to keep us away from vices and to fight for drug misuse. You have 15 minutes to perform this task and your output will be graded based on the rubrics flash on the screen. Now, the question is, are you all ready? If yes, let us begin! My dear learners, I know that many of you love to play instruments, don't you? So my question then is, why do you play instruments? Yes, Don? When every time I play guitar, sir, I can feel happiness. I feel that I am connected with the singer and composer of the song. I am relaxed when every time I hold my guitar. It seems that you are very passionate in music, Prince. Thank you. You know, class, I remember what Sarah Dyson once said. Music is the greatest unifier, an incredible force, something that people who differ on everything and anything else can have in common. This quote speaks of the way Africans consider music because they believe that music serves as a link of the actual world with that of the spiritual world. Music is indeed a vital part of everyday life in Africa. And it is good that we appreciate the origins of our music, not only in our country, but also in the entire world. Very good class! 
I salute you for accomplishing your simple video performance. You can also share this video on your Facebook timeline and YouTube channel. Let's clap for ourselves, class. Let's see if you really listen to our discussions. What are the five types of traditional musical instruments of Africa? Yes, Irish? The five types of traditional musical instruments of Africa are ejophones, membranophones, lamellophones, chordophones, and aerophones, sir. Very good, Irish. Class, can you still remember the examples of ejophones? Yes, Che? The instruments under ejophones are agogo, shekere, slit or log drum, a ting ting con or slit gong and balafon. Good job, Che. How about the instruments from membranophones? Yes, Diane. The examples of membranophones are body percussion, talking drum, and djembe. Exactly. Thank you, Diane. Don, can you give me the examples of lamellophones? Under lamellophones are. Embira and Are Embira. You are right, Don. How about you, Prince? Can you enumerate the chordophone instruments? We have musical bow and zeze under chordophone, sir. Precisely, Prince. How about earphones? Yes, Florife? We have also earphones instruments like Fulani and Kudohorn, sir. Exactly, Florife. This is just a manifestation that all of you are listening to our discussion. Now class, let us check how far have you understood our lesson for today. Get your activity notes because we will be needing this in answering our short quiz. Before you answer, do not forget to write this template. Complete the table below. Group the instruments according to their classification of sounds and describe the most distinct feature of each instrument. Copy and answer the table below on your activity notes. If you are all ready, answer these questions in 10 minutes. Let us check how much you have learned about the music of Africa by completing the sentences below. Write your answers on your activity notes. Take a screenshot of the following questions for you to be guided. This serves as your homework which will be submitted on Monday. Item number 1. African music can be characterized by blank. Item number 2. By listening to the different types of music of Africa, I realized that blank. Item number three. Music became a valuable part of the lives of African, most especially the slaves because blank. Item number four. The most distinct feature of all African musical instruments is blank. Item number 5. My learning about the music of Africa is important because blank. Do you have any clarification about the lesson? None, none sir. If none, then let's call it a day. See you again in our Musicalaman, Musicarunungan, and Musicasiyahan lessons in Isabella Telescuela. Again, I am Jolly. But not a B, I am Teacher JB. Goodbye, class.